I am a Calvinist, okay? So uh, I'm putting up my hands and gladly confessing to that theological label. I don't particularly like labels, but I think that's that, that they're useful. Um, and what I mean by Calvinism is that I believe in God's sovereignty in salvation. I'm a Christian because God has gloriously chosen me, God has gloriously worked in me, God has, by his spirit, has opened my eyes to see Christ and my need of a saviour. Uh, and he's opened my ears that I might hear the gospel. So, so yes, that's, what I'm, that's my Calvinism, and that's what I mean when I, when I use it. And I'm a happy Calvinist because if God is sovereign, then I believe that God orders all of our affairs, even down to the minute detail. Um, and he does so with infinite wisdom and care and in a way that will fulfill his purposes um, and, and, and serve the glory and the exaltation of Christ. So I think you, if you are a Calvinist, you can only be a happy Calvinist. And that's not the reputation a lot of Calvinists have, sadly, in that a lot of Calvinists have a reputation for being dour, miserable, judgmental, condemning. And, and, and that should be the very opposite of what Calvinists are. Uh, we should be men and women who are truly happy in the sense that we delight in God's sovereignty. Uh, we delight in the way that he, he superintends the affairs of our lives, how, how, how he, he measures his providence so that uh, he works out all things according uh, to his good purposes uh, for his glory and for our good. Uh, and if I believe that, how can I be anything other than a happy Calvinist? I may be a perplexed Calvinist, in that I don't know why God does what God does in the way that he does it, but I know that he's good. Um, and even in the midst of tears and pain, I'm happy because I know that God is working this out for my good and for his glory. And that's a state of glorious blessedness.